Hey guys, welcome. <laughs> Ew! You ready for this, baby? I'm ready. There's a person at your front door. Shut up. Shut up. Shut up. What's up, everybody? It's What's Ger up? <laughs> it's Georgina and Gelano back on my YouTube channel today with a very exciting video. Three, two, one. We, we bought, bought our, our first, first house. house. <laughs> <laughs> so we need to tell you guys something we bought our first house <laughs> uh, uh, beast beast mode beast mode it's time to go beast mode mm -hmm. You heard that right. We bought, bought our, our first, first house. house and today we are coming to tell you Basically everything about it. Um, this is kind of like the first video of this I don't know if it's gonna be a series. I don't freaking know But I wanted to of course tell you guys and inform you that we bought our first house and give you like Information about everything that has been going on leading up to this point because you guys are a part of this Yeah, you guys are our family <coughs> as well. So, you know, we want to tell you so that's what we're gonna be doing today I um, wrote everything down in my notes. So I <laughs> I wrote <laughs> <laughs> I wrote um, every subject down in my notes that I want to talk to you guys. <laughs> I wrote everything down in my notes app that I'm going to be talking about today. So let's get into this video because this intro is way too long. Yeah. So the first thing that I wrote down is looking for a house because I wanted to get into this because we have been looking for a house for a really, really long time. Um, I would say like two years, maybe like a little bit longer even. Yeah, it was a very long process. Yeah. From being not so serious to being very to serious. To being very serious. Yeah. And um, just like a little backstory, I don't know if you guys know, but me and Gelano have been dating for almost yeah, eight I, years. I mean, we wanted to buy our first house when we were like... 17. Yeah, we so have that's we have, <laughs> four years ago. Yeah, we have we have wanted to do this for a very long time, but obviously house cost money but what i wanted to say is me and Gelano have been dating for a very long time eight years this january and we have been ready for this next step for so long and now it's finally here so um i told you we've been looking at houses for i would say at least two years two and a half years Gelano told you it first started out as something that we didn't take too seriously so just like bra um, browsing online looking at houses and like we would occasionally send each other houses and be like oh like look at this house like it's very cool like this is what i want to have in my first house yeah but eventually it also became like a bit depressing <laughs> yeah it became very depressing honestly because like like if, the price were only getting higher and like, we were like yeah first of all house prices are freaking crazy right now li literally everywhere in the world um so another year went by and more months went by and after being not so serious for a while we were like okay like this is actually something that we want now and we need to start taking this more seriously and then we can slide into the next subject which is uh house viewings house <coughs> viewings yeah so we start with the house viewings how many house viewings have we had before we found this house maybe like seven like seven yeah seven. i think we had like seven house <coughs> viewings um yeah yeah all we, kind of different yeah we, like all kind of different properties yeah. we have looked at huge houses smaller houses bungalows apartments yeah. literally everything all of the properties that we viewed um Obviously, we viewed them because there was something that we liked about them. But when we were actually there, it just wasn't our thing. Like, if you see a house online, it's obviously going to be very different than when you see it in person. So you might be like, okay, like, this looks great. And then when you come, like, when you actually get to the house, it's like... This is not what I expected at all. Like, it looks different from the pictures. It's just, like, you need to have that vibe when you step into the house. Like, you literally have to be like, okay, I have a good feeling about this. Like, I love it. And this is just, like, it It just needs to feel right. Yeah, even if it's, like, 
totally out of your area yeah you know what i mean yeah. so when you enter the home when you enter the neighborhood you have to have this you, you need to have yeah you just need like, to have that okay, feeling i could get used to this yeah because you have to live there so you have to get a good feeling about it and then we slide into the next topic of this video which is <clears throat> the house viewing of this house the house that we bought <laughs> okay so the house viewing of the house that we bought <laughs> so to be very honest it was like five minutes but okay the house the actual house viewing yeah. you mean? we found the house online first right yeah exactly uh, via uh, just on the new it, listing yeah just I, like I, the new listings yeah. on the internet so I get a lot of messages uh, through email from the new listings and I saw this house and I showed it to you. Yeah, you sent it to me. And that's when it all And happened. that's when it kind of happened. Yeah. So we get to the house and before we enter the house, there was actually other people viewing the house mm -hmm. as well because the house was, I mean, obvious, well, not obviously, but the house was very, very wanted. So there already had been a lot of viewings for this house and we were like some of the some of the last people to view it basically so we enter the house and like i just told you like we instantly just got that good feeling like we just got a very good vibe not even from the house but also like from the outside and like the surroundings and the neighborhood it was just a very good feeling the house viewing itself was only like 10 15 minutes like it was very very quick and when we were there basically we loved everything of it right yeah a just lot of details the house was basically it was just the perfect house for our first house you fell in love with it i fell in love with it and we just had the best feeling about it and the funny thing is when we were at the viewing like the guy told us there were a lot of people that were interested so like a lot of people were gonna bid on the house and i was kind of thinking like oh like we're not gonna get it because there are so many people interested in it i was like oh we're one of the last ones to view it it's just like i feel i kind of had the feeling that we were too late if that makes sense well that was my feeling i think you had a different feeling i think you were like okay <coughs> this is this is it yeah, you I were mean, very like we, we positive both, yeah. and we both went through the same process, but in a very, di very different yeah, way. Yeah, through a very different yeah, way. Yeah, from the beginning to the end. Yeah. You were <laughs> more stressful and yeah. those kind of things. Exactly. I was super stressed and I was literally going uh, like all the time going like, oh, like I really want this. I don't know. I just don't know if we're going to get it. And Jelana was like, oh, no, it's fine. Like, we're going to get this. Don't worry. Yeah. <laughs> he was very like yeah. relaxed and which is what I needed because I'm like a very stressful person <laughs> so i i needed that from you so then we went home and the realtor told us that there was going to be a day that all like the bids of the house were going to come in at a certain time so we had to put a bid in Jelano actually put it in but, i didn't yeah for your information you can't see the bids of other people so you yeah. just bid it's like a blind so if your bid is like very low they won't tell you they, they just say it's too or, low yeah it's like too, you're out of the game yeah Just you're out of move. the game <laughs> so they told us okay uh, the day and the time you have to put your bid in jelano put the bid in and they told us i think we put it in on friday or something like that and they told us um we're gonna like call like if you are one of the one of the like top contestants i don't i don't freaking know basically we're gonna call you back or send you an email or like <laughs> Get in, get in contact with you. Yeah. So before we <laughs> so before we slide into the next uh, subject, Jelana wants to tell you guys something. That is, uh, we really need to mention this before sliding in the next next subject. Uh, nowadays, there are so many uh, like buyers and not so many sellers. If that makes sense. So the buyers uh, nowadays really have to give it to you. Like if you have to hide, the sellers really have uh, to give it to you. I'm sorry, the sellers really have to give it to you. It's not it's only not a factor of like, oh, you have the highest bid, so you get it. No, you really need to be clever and like try to form a bond with the realtor, with the people selling yeah, it. Yeah, like, just like really that's show. That's my experience. Yeah, just really show like we are serious about this yeah. and we really want this and yeah. I've heard this from other people too and we have experienced Experience, experience it as well yeah yeah so i told you um, we put the bid in on friday and they told us they were gonna call back on monday so we were kind of like okay let's just like uh, relax this weekend even though i couldn't because i was freaking stressed i was like oh my gosh like 
I need this, like, I just want to know now. Um, and luckily, they actually called back sooner, but before I get to the call, Jelano sent them an email. Yeah, um, I was just going with my... Gut feeling? Yeah. So, um, they told us they were gonna call back on Monday. They, I, they actually called sooner, but I believe the reason that they actually called yeah, sooner... that was the reason. That was the reason, yeah. is because in between that time, Jelano actually sent them an email and he said something like... Um, like, just want to let you know, we are really serious about this and really we, love we really That's love it. the house and we are just obsessed with it. And like, he just had a feeling that, okay, I just need to send this email just to like <clears throat> show. Re yeah, to give <laughs> all of our effort, like you yeah. can place a bit, but then it's like, oh. Yeah. But you have their email address, so why not give them Exactly, shit? just that little bit of effort yeah. that showed them that we yeah. were... Um, more basically more interested yeah, than really, the other people yeah, that was really the key ingredient <laughs> we were actually like in the top two or three or so well you 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 never know but we think that because we got a call back so we must have been like in the top like bids basically so there were a couple of other people that placed a higher bid but they said we actually don't know if we want the house yet like we need a week to think about it and then we were like, okay, but we don't have to think about it. Like, we are sure that we want this. So then he was just kind of like, okay, if you're sure, like, we can just get this settled right now. You are getting the house. Yeah, exactly. And that was really a bit like a, through my email. That was the starting point. Yeah, of because of Jelano's email, it was kind of like that little extra push that showed just more interest that yeah. really got us there and this is not something like that is written down you really have to go with your gut feeling and just do something you think would work to get your yeah your... exactly because maybe other people would think like why would you send them an email like isn't that unprofessional or something like, or like the, why would you yeah, the, the, try to get you know what i mean it isn't written in the rules that would help you but that's not how it works yeah but it did help us so now I have a funny story. Um, I actually recorded myself when we got the call, um, basically of the realtor telling us that we got the house. And I will give a little backstory to that video because I'm about to show it to you. Um, they actually called Jelano. His phone was right next to me. I was on the bed and his phone was right, was right next to me. But Jelano was on the toilet. Pooping. <laughs> Jelano was on the toilet and his phone rang and it was like a number that he didn't save so like usually like we don't answer but of course like we were busy with this and like we knew that we might get some calls from like unsaved numbers basically so I ran with Jelano's telephone to the bathroom and I'm like like take this like <laughs> <laughs> take the phone like you're getting a call and he's like no you take it i was like no you take it like it could be the realtor like i'm yeah, too freaking like nervous the <laughs> yeah he was on the freaking toilet i was just like i don't care like here's a here's the phone you take the call don't care if you're on the toilet doesn't yeah, matter I've just take it, it. Doesn't, it doesn't, doesn't matter, matter. the people as on long the other as you don't make a the... sound so now let's let... just play the clip <laughs> now let's play the clip of us finding out we got the house and me being hysterical So that kind of brings us um, to the point where we have been for the past couple of weeks and the point to where we are now. So basically when you buy a house, it's not just like, you want to buy this house? Here, you can have the keys and move in. No. It's, it, the process does not go like that. It's a very lengthy, lengthy process. You need to get a shit ton of paperwork together. Um, we worked with a mortgage advisor, with uh, our accountant to get everything ready. Let's just say, <laughs> when you get the thought of like, I want to buy a house, house, just prepare for a very stressful period. period. Yeah. A very stressful period, especially if you are a person that has anxiety. <laughs> so getting the paperwork ready and everything, basically the whole boring, a lengthy process of it that we I don't really want to get into because it's just a lot um, Where are we now? So we basically yesterday got the okay 
that everything is basically okay and we are getting the house like everything is approved we are like the house is gonna be ours we already have um a date scheduled like an appointment for the what's it called like the the key transfer or like yeah. the day that you're gonna get the key yeah. so that's where basically we are right now it's actually um i just wanted to say this but it's october 15th this video is probably not going to be uploaded for another month but yeah. i just want to let you guys know how like spread out this is over uh, yeah some I'm, months if that makes sense like the process only with buying this house it's it's already like been six weeks like maybe even two months ago it, that yeah we, like, like, we started with we this start house. like from the point that we saw the house to now it's taken us at least two months yeah so it's not just i want it i buy it i got it i move in no and we wish it I was like that but yeah we, we haven't even thought about like buying furniture and matching furniture and yeah. clothes and everything so let's get into that right now because that is kind of the fun part okay. our plans for the house and buying furniture we told you guys um the house is pretty much done there's just a couple of things that we want to do there's some rooms in the house that have wallpaper that just needs to come down and we need to paint some things and we need to change some things but it's like that's pretty much that there is to do besides buying furniture so yeah let me get furniture. in yeah so let me get into the furniture um also very stressful we are two perfectionists Jelano has OCD. Sometimes we even like, we're like. <laughs> <laughs> it's very like, uh. Jelano has OCD. I'm a perfectionist. So just imagine like in your head, how that, how that works. Like even it doesn't picking really work. between two colors would take us like days. It's like, but I, I do have to say like before, we were really prepared especially with yeah. furniture like yeah. as i said i'm a perfectionist and i like to be very organized if you look on my pinterest i have like maps saved on how i wanted our first house to exactly look like basically i have folders for what i wanted to the um living room to look like what i wanted the kitchen to look like what i wanted the, the bedroom to look like and before we even bought this house or even had seen this house i shared that with jelano and i was I pretty much said like if we buy our first house like this is what I want it to look like and obviously ask for his input and ask if he was okay with it or like the things that he wanted in his house so we were like really prepared for that so we did kind of knew already what kind of furniture and colors and theme and things that we wanted so it's not like we're going into like the deep end and we and we didn't know what we wanted you know what i mean like yeah but but that's where most things as we already said like we we are mentally preparing for yeah. this moment for like four to five years yeah. like for everything in our like we, that's another topic like yeah. preparing f <laughs> yeah no but it's true like we were already prepared for this even though it hadn't even happened yet it's like weird, but we have been thinking about this, talking about this, manifesting this for years. That's also something like why we're done with most of our furniture, like the big things, the couch, the... Yeah, because we already knew pretty much exactly what we wanted. Yeah, I really hope this video just makes sense, like, <laughs> just so. Yeah, but you know, it's a process. It yeah. doesn't have to be perfect. This video was a... An, a very good representation of what's been going yeah. on for the past couple of, couple of months. Like so the, prepare yourself for your own uh, yeah. experience. Um, but yeah, furniture stores, how many have we had? I would say 50. Yeah, something like that. Um, but yeah, just let me skip through this like about the furniture because like I said, I don't really want to relive that. It, it was really like, it took a really long time. But we got a lot of pieces custom made. We got our couch custom made, like the fabric and the color. We got our bed custom made the fabric like dimensions color we got <coughs> we got our dining table custom made it's going to be very very pretty <laughs> and now i just uh, wanted to get into the last topic about this video is how we are going to continue this and like how does the series continue because like i told you guys in the beginning of this video we want to involve you guys in this process um I just want to like like I wish I could just like show you everything of the house right now but for like privacy 
and stuff like that i just really don't want to do that yet like you guys will obviously see like the transformations like the room um transformations the before and after and us like moving in um but i'm not gonna do like like an empty house tour or something just yet just because with private like we are very like private people and we do want to share a lot with you guys but we just want to keep that it, like it a little like two sides really yeah um i think it's gonna be like you guys will see everything like eventually especially when everything is done just wanted to say that like i'm we're gonna take you guys with us but we're not gonna like fully like this is where we sleep this is where we eat this is where we shit so uh yeah definitely expect more videos about like transformations moving packing uh, painting, setting up furniture, the whole freaking Sherman bling, 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 bling. And then uh, I also want to say, Joanna just reminded me, I do also have some good news because besides YouTube, I am also going to be documenting everything on our home account. I made um, a home account for our house and it's going to be on the screen right here. So if you guys follow this account on Instagram, you are just going to be getting live updates on everything that's happening, everything that's going on, everything that's changing, taking place, basically just being there live with us. Um, like I said, I'm also going to do it on YouTube, but like Instagram with stories and everything, it's just much more real life and like yeah. in the moment. Yeah. So that's why I also wanted to do the home account. We have so much more exciting news, but that's it for now this is exciting exciting enough yeah i thought you were gonna say this is anxiety enough <laughs> <laughs> also for you it's exciting enough for me it's, it's anxiety yeah. enough <laughs> bye okay guys so that is going to be the end to this very long we bought our first house video yeah. now we well we wanted to film this video because we just wanted to get it out there and share it with you so i really hope you enjoyed this video Make sure to like, like subscribe, subscribe, turn on your post notifications, follow me on Instagram, which is at Georgina Juanita. Also, don't forget to follow my brand at GGB Beauty. And also, don't forget to follow our home account right here on the screen. And Gelano, of course, if you want to. Yeah, I'm not very active right now. He's not very active and big on Instagram, but who knows, he might be in the future sometime. So you're getting a call okay we're gonna end this video right now bye love you guys bye ciao <laughs>